Hi friends, it's Skye. Welcome to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day so far. Today I'm going to be doing a speed build of a rustic farmer's market. And this was the last land area that I needed to decorate for my island. So aside from beaches, my island is now done. This video will be a little bit different in that I'm not going to be doing commentary all the way through. But I do hope you enjoy watching my build process and I will be leaving codes and the items that I use down in the video description down below. So let's get started. idea and area was definitely inspired by the farmer's market that I go to often in my own town. I also knew it was an idea that would go with my theme pretty well and before you get to this area is the Nook's Cranny and Maple Sisters and so I thought that a farmer's market sort of in the shopping district was perfect. I hadn't done a build like this before, so it was a bit tricky at first to figure out the dimensions and where I needed to build extra cliff in order to place items, but I ended up figuring everything out and getting everything where I wanted it, and then I was able to take off the bits of extra cliff um, behind the build. Mm -hmm.
all the same shades of brown for items, I decided to use many different shades of brown and make it very eclectic and rustic looking. But right here, I am just beginning to decorate uh, the dining area and what I had in mind for this was sort of a farm to table dining experience.
for this area off video, I just added a fruit basket, a spooky tower, and a printed design shovel to finish it up. Now I just have to do a bit more speed pathing and landscaping to finish off this area. last land area that I had to decorate. There might be some areas that need like just a couple more details, but this was the last main area besides the beaches. So once I do those, my island will be complete and I will be releasing a dream address and also doing a tour here on my channel. And also if you would like to see speed builds of some of those beaches, definitely let me know. I went ahead and time travel to morning so that we could get better lighting for this area, but here is the finished product. Here we have the little farm to table restaurant in front of the main building of the farmer's market, and I'm super happy with how this whole area turned out. If you enjoyed watching this video, Please give it a like to support my channel and also consider subscribing so you don't miss any new content from me. Thank you so much for watching and spending some time with me today. I hope to see you all next time.